Hello, today I'll be experimenting with Charles Darwin's principle of diversification in an area. Now, here with me I have the book Origin of Species and I'll read out an extract about the principle. It says that the truth of the principle that the greatest amount of life can be supported by great diversification of structure is seen under many natural circumstances. And then it says, most of the animals and plants which live close round any small piece of ground could live on it and may be said to be striving to the utmost to live there. But it is seen that where they come into the closest competition with each other, the advantages of diversification of structure of the species with the accompanying differences of habit and constitution determine that the inhabitants as a general rule belong to what we call different genera and orders. So actually what here Darwin is trying to say that in a given area, let's say a plot of land, the species or the organisms that are growing will have a greater sustainability if the individuals are more diversified, that is being from different genera or different species or different varieties of a similar species. Now I am going to verify this Darwin's principle of diversification using the seeds as you can see here. So here I have three species of seeds as you can see. These are from the genus Wigna. This one is Wigna mungo. This one is Wigna actinifolia. And this one is Wigna radiata. So what I am going to do, I have taken these two containers having moist soil, equal amounts of moist soil. Now what I have here is, here in this part I have 24 seeds of Vigna Mumo. So what I will do is, I will add this sample to one of the two soils. Now here I have 8 of Vigna actinifolia, 8 of Vigna radiata and 8 seeds of Vigna mungo and total 24 seeds so I'll add it to this one. So let's see for a few days I'll leave these two samples to germinate and then we'll comment on the results that we obtain. So here I have my seeds back germinated. So this one is the one having only the Vigna mungo seeds, the black ones and this one having all the three different species of Vigna. So if you may notice that the growth the germination is more in this case so well in support with the Darwin's principle of diversification we have seen that when the diversity of species is greater that is here three species were present but here only one species was present this one having diverse species has shown greater sustainability of all the individuals just to confirm you can see I'll just take the seed coat here the black seed coat of Vigna Mungo you can just see here this seedling having the seed coat the brown seed coat of Vigna actinifolia so basically the competition in the first sample is greater because all the individuals are competitive to each other but in this one there is a lesser degree of competition between the individuals so greater sustainability so thank you for watching this video 
and do subscribe like and share this video